What's up, tubers? It's James here, and welcome to Fresh Movie Reviews for The Nun, the fifth movie out of the Conjuring universe. And it, well, technically, okay. So it goes Conjuring, uh, Conjuring 2, no, no, sorry, it goes Conjuring, Annabelle, Conjuring 2, Annabelle Creation, The Nun. But if you were to go to it in chronolo uh, chronological time order, it goes The Nun, Annabelle Creation, Conjuring... No, 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 no. Annabelle Creation, Annabelle, Conjuring, and then Conjuring 2. And um, no one noteworthy in, this, in the cast, really. We got... Father Burke, played by Damien Bersh... I'm going to shit all over these names. I do apologise. Um, we've, got, we've got Tazina Farminga as Sister Irene. And she, uh, you may know her as um, the daughter in um, season one of American Horror Story. Uh, she's kind of grown up a bit. And um, she's got a few roles under her belt. But she started off in American Horror Story. She's the one where she argues with her boyfriend, like, I hate you, man. We have uh, Jonas Blanquer as Frenchie, who's a hornball. I'll, I'll say, yeah. And we have Bonnie Ahrens as the nun, and she, the nose on this woman. I'm sorry to say, but the fucking nose on this woman. <laughs> um, well... It's set in 1952 or 57. Um, and uh, the, there's a demon on the loose, Valak, the old demon possessing snake, charming Valak, um, which is a true demon. Um, Warner Brothers was going to go to, I don't know, sue someone. To prove that ghosts were real or aren't real, or, and but the case of never came through. It's like ah, but um, I was expecting a lot of jump scares. Like I was expecting like Bleh! there there were a few, there were a few. There was like a whole a few holy shit moments. Um, it was a good how it came to be. Uh, there were a few laughs in it, which felt very forced. It's like why. But in the Conjuring universe, it's like, okay. Um, <clears throat> so if you watch Conjuring 1, the Warrens explain their first case, or a, a case, and it turns out it was the case from the nun. Um, and um, the Frenchie got possessed and all that shit, and the nun found, the, the Valak found their way to, to them. It's like, holy shit. And it's like, okay. Um, <coughs> enjoyment wise, I would go Conjuring 2, Annabelle, the Nun, no, no, sorry, Conjuring 2, the Nun, Annabelle, um, Annabelle Creation, and then the, uh, Conjuring, um, which goes to the Nun a little bit for me. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this was, this has a few good jump scares, it had a good history of it and all that stuff, um, apparently the place is real, the de the Valak is real and all that stuff, it's like, holy fucking shit, um, okay, cool, cool, um, what's coming up next is that we're getting, uh, Conjuring 3, Annabelle 3 and another spin-off of The Crooked Man. Now, the crooked man, he appeared in, um, what, what did he appear in? He appeared in Conjuring 2, just just for, like, a few minutes. It's like, okay, don't know shit about him, but we're going to learn about, more about him and all that. <clears throat> um, now, for the Conjuring universe, uh, I give this an 8. Like it, like I said, it had some jump scares <laughs> and all that. Um, acting... Acting was okay. It wasn't really about the actors. Like, they didn't, like... 
I wouldn't say go see this movie for the actors. I would say go for the for the premise for the for the you know the music. You can feel the dread pumping up, and it's like holy fucking shit, and it's just like. Oh, and if you want to see Bonnie Anders as the fucking nun, like, she, she she fucking owns that thing again. It's like, holy shit. And and make your jokes throughout the movie. Like, there there's a there's a ball that has the blood of Christ and looks like the holy hand grenade from the Monty Python movie. And it's just like, what the hell? Um, went on a, uh, as I'm recording this, I went on, a, on Tuesday night with my friends and... Choose it like movies for us, for Tasmanians, for Australians, or whatever. They come out on Thursday, and it still had a pretty good uh, crowd for a Tuesday night, which was, which is pretty interesting. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> hi, uh, if you guys seen the Nun, uh, what was your favorite part about it? Like, um, I liked the fact that. It got in your head. Like, the priest was buried alive. And that's just, that's fucking scary. But, um, yeah. Uh, and out of the Conjuring universe, out of all five, so far, which ones do you like the most? Like I said, I like Conjuring 2, The Nun, Annabelle, uh, Annabelle Creation, and then Conjuring. Um, yeah, and The Nun is, like, the fucking scariest. I screamed like a little bitch when I, um, first saw Conjuring 2. I was like, <laughs> Yeah, um, and hopefully we're going to get some more stories out of the Conjuring universe. Um, like, share, subscribe, leave a comment of what you liked about the movie, what you hated about the movie, what you think about the Warrens. Like, I've heard that, um, I heard that Ed Warren was a drunk and an asshole. Like, they got work, but... Lorraine had to do much of the talking because he, he just, no. But yeah. Um, yeah. Um, so I'm going to leave the light on as I go to sleep tonight. No, I'm not. It's like, it, it was, it had its moments, but like, I was even scarier. But it was, it's good for a fright. Um, what is coming next well, that I'm going to see is Mandy. And I'm coming at you probably twice for that because Nicolas Cage. Yeah. <laughs> Um, thanks guys. Like I said, like, share and subscribe.